Hello, my name is Orla Cullen and I'm a product manager as part of the Advanced Analytics team. And I'm here today to talk to you about a very exciting collaboration between SAP s for hana and SAP Business Objects Predictive Analytics and some of the really new exciting features that we will be delivering with SAP s for hana Cloud Edition in 1705. Before we talk about that, let's talk a little about the existing embedded analytics capabilities that exist in s for hana today. Today, we can act, look at visualizing trends, we could aggregate data, and all of this can be done directly within the s hana application itself. But as we know, analytical trends are shifting within the marketplace, and we know there is an even more focus on machine learning and predictive capabilities. We know our customers want to spend more time looking at future trends, and also maybe identifying insights in their data that potentially wouldn't be seen by the human eye. So to set the scene a little bit, let's talk about S4HANA's digital core. And by that I mean S4HANA sits on HANA, and HANA in itself has its own predictive engine. But not only that, it has access to a number of predictive libraries, like APL, PAL, and even R. So here at the Predictive Analytics team, we've been working on a brand new component. And that component is called the Predictive Analytics Integrator, or PI for short. And what PI enables us to do is to integrate machine learning and predictive capabilities directly into SAP applications. So the insights or the forecasts can be consumed directly by the business user in their own environment. And also we can put different forecasts directly to decision makers. With SAP s for hana Cloud Edition 1705, we'll be releasing our very first use case. And that will be in the area of s for hana procurement. So we know contract management is a very important part of the procurement process. If a contract is to expire ahead of time, we maybe lose time in negotiating a brand new deal with our vendors. So what if we were able to forecast that a contract could be consumed ahead of time? In this situation, the buyer could proactively start a sourcing activity and begin negotiating with their buyers, potentially getting a much better deal for their company. Traditionally, uh, embedded analytics, we have delivered a number of capabilities with s for hana The process that we followed is from relatively straightforward. Firstly, we identify the data, then we code the KPI or report logic, we build an easy-to-use UI, and we ship these for our customers to consume. So with predictive analytics, we're not changing this. The process will remain the same, only this time we are introducing a new concept called the predictive scenario. So a predictive scenario is basically just a business question. And to answer this business question, we need to identify a few inputs. The first being where the data comes from. The second is the algorithm type we want to use. And the third being the output we want to give back to the user. Again, the next steps that we follow are exactly the same as the other embedded applications. We build the UI, we add this predictive scenario, and we ship to our customers. The only thing that is slightly different here is when we ship these uh, predictive scenarios, we're not ship shipping trained models. We're actually shipping a model template because it's important that these models are trained on the customer's own data. And also, we want to make sure this is as easy as possible for you to do. So we have created a brand new Fiori tile that will be shipped with s for hana which will enable you to manage the full life cycle of all your predictive models. Within the tile, you'll be able to train your model, review the quality of the model, because the last thing we want is for people to make bad decisions on models that aren't very well trained. The next thing we need to do is activate the model so it can be used by business users. And finally, as we know that models can degrade over time and we want to keep them as up to date as possible, you can retrain those models directly within the s for hana application. Finally, uh, we have a number of new resources coming in the coming months, so please visit our roadmap, our community pages, and our education for additional information. Thank you.